Alright. I got a lot of comments and stuff and questions and concerns on the, the free energy aspect of all of what, you know. I mean, really, if you want to know the truth, it, even myself, I was skeptical too, you see what I mean? But there's so many ways to get free energy, it's ridiculous. Not, you know, withstanding the Newman motor, which obviously I'm putting these batteries, it's, it's only got like one volt, and you know what I'm saying, they're dead. The two other ones, but now we'll look at the uh, Tesla Tower thing again. This is my ion generator. As you can see, here's this uh, symbol. There's nothing touching it. I, I actually had somebody tell me to turn the light on. Let me move my tripod for my camera over. You can see there's nothing touching this symbol here, right here. This is my ion generator. All it does is puts out uh, static voltage. Which would be the same thing if I, as if I put this symbol up in the air. For every uh, three feet that I put this symbol away from the ground, there's a potential difference of 100 volts. So if I put it up 10 feet, it's 1,000 volts. If I put it up 100 feet, it's a uh, 10,000 volts difference. So I could stick it up on this tree in the back, which I think I'll do uh, on the next video, and run a wire down to the ground, an insulated wire, uh, you know, toward the ground, and then plug a uh, stick a rod in the ground, so that we can show that it's a potential difference. But here it is. It's hard for me to hold all this, so I'm gonna put this light on here. And as you can see, I'm gonna put my hand on here. I'm not getting shocked. It's just static. Okay. Now, I'm going to move the uh, symbol over here so you can see there's, now I'll get the light again so you can see it's not touching this symbol, right? Now, here's the bottom of the, the symbol stand. I'm gonna, I got a sock on too. I'm going to put my foot on the ground, which would be the bottom of the symbol. So I'm grounding it myself. And as you can see, or here at least, It's collecting the uh, static out the air. I mean, it's that simple. Then all we have to do is run that through the... Oh, no, let me hold this thing here. Now, you, you can hear that, right? All we have to do is that pulsating DC that it's uh, collecting. We just run that through the step-down transformer thereby converting the high voltage pulsing DC into a lower current because when you step down the voltage the current uh, the voltage gets stepped down but the, the current goes up so I'll, I'll upload this and then I'm, then I'll go ahead and film the next uh, part of this alright y'all peace out